whispers of a woman bathing in the blood of virgins to maintain her youth have echoed across centuries. An enigma wrapped in a riddle, swathed in a legend, the notorious Elizabeth Bathory. But how much do we truly know about the life of this infamous Hungarian noblewoman? Let's unravel the complex tapestry of her life thread by thread. Born into one of the oldest and most powerful noble families in Hungary, the Bathory clan, in August 1560, Elizabeth's life was destined for grandeur. However, her childhood was punctuated by a series of disturbing events. Witnessing brutal punishments meted out by her family's officers, and suffering from seizures and fits speculated to be due to epilepsy, Elizabeth's early years were far from idyllic. As was customary for nobility, Elizabeth's marriage was a political alliance. At the tender age of 15, she wed Count Ferenc Nadasti, a union that would produce four children. However, it was during her husband's frequent absences due to war that Elizabeth's infamous reputation began to take shape. Stories began to circulate about the mistreatment of her servants, escalating to accusations of torture. It was after the death of her husband in 1604 that these rumors reached a fever pitch. The tales grew darker, speaking of a woman who not only tortured her servants but killed them, bathing in their blood to retain her youth. The accusations were so grave that King Matthias II ordered an investigation. The subsequent trial, based largely on the testimonies of over 300 witnesses and survivors, led to the conviction of Elizabeth's accomplices. But Elizabeth herself was never formally tried or convicted. Instead, the Blood Countess was confined to a room within her castle, with only small slits for food and air. This was to be her prison for the last four years of her life until she was found dead in 1614. But what of the legacy of Elizabeth Bathory? Does she remain a symbol of sadistic cruelty, or is there more to her story? The narrative of her life is a complex one, filled with alleged atrocities and scandal, but also shrouded in political intrigue and conjecture. Many historians argue that the allegations against Elizabeth were politically motivated, a scheme to bring down a powerful and wealthy widow who had become too independent. Others maintain that her guilt is undeniable, citing the numerous testimonies against her. In popular culture, Elizabeth Bathory has become synonymous with vampirism, her legend inspiring countless films, books, and even music. She is a symbol of horror, a chilling reminder of the dark side of nobility. But whatever the truth of her crimes, the legend of Elizabeth Bathory continues to captivate. A woman of power, caught in the crosshairs of politics and fear, her tale is a stark reminder of the complexities of history and the enduring power of legend.